Leaders gathered in Ashland today for the new campus groundbreaking of Rankin Technical College, which is set to open its doors in 2023. ABC 17's Layla Mitchell is live from the property where the college will be built. And Layla, you heard school leaders talk about how this will affect students, the city of Ashland, and also the state as a whole. Deb, everyone involved said by creating more technical learning opportunities for students in Ashland, that would lead to great workforce success in Missouri. We need to work to keep jobs here in America, here in Missouri, here in my hometown of Ashland, and this center will do just that. The economic impact of Rankin will go beyond the campus. Work to build the new Ashland campus of Rankin Technical College is expected to create 163 jobs in Ashland. So many communities talk about workforce development, very few communities do something about workforce development. The federal government will spend four and a half million dollars to build it. The city is trying to raise the other three million dollars to finish the project. The college is putting a heavy emphasis on hands-on learning and focus primarily on construction trades, information technology, and medical training. Southern Boone School Superintendent Chris Femley says this type of education will help Ashland students go in there and we introduce technical skills to students and we prepare them with entry level skills to go out and become an entry level worker. The college will give high school students the opportunity to take classes through Rankin, giving them a head start to prepare for careers in Missouri's workforce. To train high school and adult students for successful careers that meet the needs of our industries. The college is expected to help Ashland grow its population and expand the retail and business community. The school system, it really is what draws a major draw for uh, people coming to Ashland. Representative Sarah Wall says she's working to get one and a half million dollars in state money to help build the school. For now, reporting live in Ashland, I'm Layla Mitchell, ABC 17 News. All right, thanks, Layla.